The Mobile Sensing Laboratory at the University of Iowa is working on wearable Internet of Things devices such as smart glasses, smart watches, or cloud-enabled hearing aids. Uh, these devices collect data about the environment in which they operate and uh, their users using a multitude of sensors. They use machine learning techniques to make sense of the data that they have collected. And these devices can communicate with each other wirelessly or access cloud services over the internet. Today, such devices are limited in both their energy availability, the limited battery resources that they have, as well as in terms of their computational capabilities because they, they need to be small so they can be worn. Our work aims to transcend these limitations. As an example of the tremendous impact that these devices will have on our daily lives, imagine how a cloud-enabled hearing aid may benefit somebody who is suffering from hearing loss. Consider that a woman would want to meet with her friends in a coffee shop. When she goes to the coffee shop, it is a noisy environment. Because the hearing aid has limited computational power and battery, it may not allow her to differentiate her friend's conversation from the background. Our work envisions hearing aids that would instead utilize the computational power of cloud services to run more advanced signal processing algorithms than it is possible using today's uh, limited computational and battery constraints. Deep learning algorithms that are more computational demanding and require more battery power could run in the cloud to pinpoint the environmental characteristics of the coffee shop and improve speech quality and understanding in these demanding conditions. The key research challenge for building such wearable IoT devices is to develop applications that adapt in response to the changes in the environment in which they operate or changes in the way the user interacts with them. Traditional computer applications are designed to operate in closed environments, which do not change. Our entire software infrastructure, from operating systems to compilers, is designed around this assumption that the user's needs do not change and that the characteristics of the environment remain the same. Clearly, this is not true for wearable IoT apps. For example, as the user moves, she may lose connectivity to the cloud. Depending on the location, she may lose access to cloud services or edge services, experience different interaction patterns with the user, and require variable workloads. The consequence of this situation is that current apps require significant development effort to ensure that they operate reliably and to optimize their energy consumption and responsiveness. Developers often have to repeatedly measure the performance of their apps to tune and improve their performance. Our lab works on developing programming abstractions and tools to simplify the development of adapted apps that are more reliable and easier to program. Reliability is essential for ensuring that apps such as edge and cloud-enabled hearing aids will be accepted and trusted by their users. Programmability is essential for unleashing the full potential of an ecosystem of IoT applications that will be pervasive in our daily lives. So our focus is on developing programming abstractions and tools that developers may use to optimize the operation of their applications based on their interaction with their users and the environment in which they operate in. These tools will allow programmers uh, to adapt their applications either at compiler runtime to the dynamic environments 
that a real-world user may encounter.